All right, so this is a suggestion via donation. Uh, the name of the video is uh, Police Can't Stop This Self-Driving Car. Let's check it out. Hello, everyone. This is your daily dose of internet. This police officer wanted these people to pull over, but they were in a self-driving taxi. Let us move! <laughs> we're, we're, we're not driving! <laughs> Guys, I wondered, like, what would happen if this actually became a thing? Like, how do you pull over these vehicles? They're not going to pull over because who are you going to ticket? You going to ticket the car? Who's going to pay it? Seriously, I never. I mean, I never really uh, like tried to come up with a reason, like any type of reasoning behind it. But now it kind of makes sense. I think we probably should with how technology is going. Like a lot of the Teslas have like a package where you can just get basically like uh, almost full driving, right? Um, so yeah. He's trying who gets to the ticket? <laughs> Sir, there's no one there. <laughs> and literally, as he's sitting there just waving the, the vehicle onto the side, how does the, the vehicle's not going to go to the side? He's trying to... <laughs> Sir, there's no one there. All right, we're protesting. Thank you. What You're are we protesting? We're protesting What's everything. That? We're angry. No, we're not going to take it anymore. <laughs> I love it. I love the idea of that. Someone drop? No, 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 no. Don't don't just gloss over this. It's like a like a box truck drifting. Someone dropped well, their phone in the otter enclosure, and the otter thought it was a clam and tried to break it open. Oh boy, you never get that back. You never get that back. <laughs> Your screen is all cracked. Forget that. Let him have. This guy made a makeshift bagpipe. How often does that happen? Like, what? First of all, you're lucky, obviously. I mean, I get it. I mean, I'm sure the lightning strikes the ocean a lot because, I mean, it covers most of the surface of the earth. We get that, right? But this is a once in a lifetime like, event. Like, you literally are filming out the window when lightning strikes. Bro, play the lottery. And I will suggest that this guy anyone. made a makeshift bagpipe using a balloon and a harmonica. harmonica. <laughs> that sounds like a bagpipe. It does. It does. That constant stream of air being pushed into the harmonica. This person tried to trick their dog into eating their medicine. Did it work? <laughs> I didn't work. Of course not. Bro, bro, listen, they're smarter than you think. Didn't want that. Should have mashed it up or something, bro. No, that's not whale barf. Don't worry. Sometimes whales will filter feed by sucking sand off the ocean floor and then spitting it out. <laughs> well, thank you. Virtual reality construction workers are now a thing. Caterpillar made their construction equipment controllable from anywhere in the world. So these vehicles could all be controlled by someone thousands of miles away. Guys, I've seen a couple of people um, like talk about this very specific thing, this technology. I think it's genius. Um, imagine like all this with all this remote work, like how that's working out or how, how our planet has somehow gone to remote working, right? Um, this makes all the sense in the world. It's also very, it's, all, it's also very genius. Like, think about it. You become extremely proficient in this very specific thing. I would say add like some type of like you know VR you know headset rather than all those monitors. I'd, I probably would prefer to be in VR doing this, right? Um, but either way, uh, I do think that this is absolutely smart. We need more of these type of things, guys. Imagine just getting the vehicle and then hiring someone from somewhere where, where wherever they are, right? Um, to come and do these things, guys, genius. There's a lot of money in that, I'm sure. Wh whoever can do that. Like a UAV. Okay. This has to be the happiest and most relaxed chicken I've ever oh. seen. Okay. Is it alive? Oh. 
This owl has been trying for a long time to have babies, but the eggs would never hatch. So these people put some baby owls in her nest while she was gone to see if the owl would adapt them. When she came back, she immediately accepted them as her own. Guys, that's, that's super wholesome and, and very touching. Okay, I like that last one. That was, that was good. Local plates on that one. This is pretty cool. This I never understood small dogs, guys. Just really quickly, I've, I've never really understood them. I, I mean, I know they exist. Obviously, obviously they exist, right? But I, I never really wanted one. Um, I never looked at them and, been, and I've never been like, oh, these are such a, a beautiful animal. I never never did that. I mean, my, my dogs are 200 plus pounds a piece, bro. So when I, I think of it, I'm just like, I don't know what I would do with a small dog. What can they do? Can they hunt? Um... Can they stop a predator before I can get to it? Or I'm not referring to human predators, guys, right? I mean, obviously, I don't, I don't like the concept of like protection animals like that because I don't want to, I don't want the animal to, to be forced into like mentally giving up its life for me, right? But um, as like an early warning system to someone attempting to do something terrible at your at your property, guys, that's cool. I think, right? I feed you. At least you can tell me if someone's trying to, you know, do a violent, forceful entry to my 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 property, guys. Right? I mean, that's a good thing. But other than that, I don't really like the concept of like um, risking the life of another being for for me. If that makes any sense, guys. Um, and that's why I don't really understand small dogs. Like, well, well, honestly, a small dog could probably also do the alerting. Okay, that is yeah. I guess. What's the point? Vanity, maybe. Huh. I never thought about it like that it's, you know, until right now. Um, but I don't know. Maybe just the size and the imposing nature of it. Um, I don't know, guys. I just like big animals, bro. I think that's what it is. It's just me, personally. This guy made a device that can close and lock bathroom stalls if the door latch isn't working properly. Okay. I mean, genius. That's a genius thing, but I'm going to point out. Uh, what place are you in that that even is a worry? Like, think about it. For him to make that, this has to be a very serious worry of his. <laughs> this dog was taking a that'll never happen again. Long time to wake up after surgery, so they used a treat to help out. What is that? Oh my goodness! Oh my god! That's a beautiful. Idea. That is the end of this video. We hope you enjoyed. Okay. And I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Later. Okay. All right. This one here was solid. Um, but again, to kind of go over the overall topic of the video itself, um, self-driving cars are here. Um, they're going to stay here. They're just going to get better and better and better until everyone basically is driving them or being driven in them, let's say. Right? Um, but what are, what are the police going to do when the... The traffic lights are down and they need to now stand in the middle of the of the lanes and, and direct traffic by hand. What are they going to do? Like, Do the cars have some type of AI built into them that recognizes police and recognizes the, the hand alert from the police? Or are they just looking for lights? Like, for example, my, my Jeep does this, right? It looks for lights, traffic lights, exclusively, right? But... Yeah, guys, I don't know. What, what are we going to do? I wish I could give you an answer. <laughs> Let me know in the comments your overall theory, though. Um, I definitely cannot wait to, to, to hear some of them, guys. Um, but all right, listen, let me know in the comments on the next thing I should be checking out. And I will get to that as soon as I possibly can. All right, then listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day and enjoy your day thoroughly.